Welcome back, everyone. We're joined now by Patrice. She is with the Polk County Conservation. How are you doing this morning? Good, thanks. Good. So we're inside. I know when you and I did some stuff together last year, we were outside in the morning and it was freezing cold. Uh, thankfully, we're inside now. But even though it's freezing and really cold outside, you guys are still have plenty of events going on for people to do, especially even this afternoon for kids. Right, exactly. So this afternoon we're doing something called After School Outdoors, and it's kind of taking off of the, some of the school systems who have the early dismissal on Wednesdays, which mm -hmm. next year will be different. Yep. Um, but just realizing, okay, what are those kids doing after school? Um, and so trying to give them an alternative to do and something active outdoors. And so with this little snow that we got last weekend, we're actually going to be snowshoeing this afternoon with them. So kind of gives kids an, outdoor, an opportunity to do something active outdoors and, and have some fun too. Okay, and so, um, you know, why do you guys want to do this stuff, whether it's with kids or adults, and keep all these outdoor events happening even through the winter months? Yeah, I think it's, first of all, you know, it's, it's about appreciation of the outdoors. Um, and it's just being active, too. We're, we're talking about, you know, healthy lifestyles and, you know, New Year's resolution. Okay, we're going to be more active. We're going to, to do things. And we also know that nature is, is a great place to relax, and it's just overall good for our health. So we want to keep people active outdoors and hopefully getting some nature appreciation as well and so you guys actually are welcoming the snow that we just had and so our upcoming <sighs> snow as well exactly yeah because uh, I had snowshoeing scheduled for the beginning of the month and it was canceled because there's no snow right so we were super excited when it was snowing on Saturday to go oh we can actually snowshoe and our cross-country ski classes coming up we also had to cancel our ice fishing last weekend because the ice wasn't safe so yeah we're actually welcoming some real winter Iowa weather to be able to play outside and so tell us a little about the cross-country skiing. Mm -hmm. Yeah, so we actually rent uh, cross-country skis and snowshoes out at Jester Park. But we also hold classes too, so people might be a little intimidated of, of going. Oh, I don't, I don't want to. I don't know how to cross country ski. How do we do it? And that's our programs too. Are all designed at the very basic level, so people can get out and try something out and not have you know the expense of purchasing things, mm -hmm. and have people helping them. And that's what our cross country ski classes and our snowshoe classes and everything else actually do. Okay, perfect. So where can we go if we want to check out a list of events? Maybe check out some of those classes. Right. So our website is going to be the best place. It's leading you outdoors.org um, and so there's a whole listing there of our calendar we've got everything all through April all kinds of activities if you're if you've got toddlers we've got things out at the Nature Center for young kids we've got programs for seniors um, and even if it is going to be too below we've got things indoors too at our Nature Center okay perfect thank you so much for being here today